this is it the ham gadgets pico keyer plus it is a memory keyer very small and it comes as a kit simple easy to put together not too many components really this is how it arrives at your doorstep kit of parts all the documentation is right here on this cd-rom and the case of this kit i ordered the optional enclosure which is only eight bucks and makes for a nice project when it's completed so let's dive into it and see what happens the first step in the process is soldering in three very small ceramic capacitors now these are small enough that unless you have extraordinary vision you're probably going to need a magnifying glass or some other instrument to identify them but it's not that difficult once you have them in place you just solder them in like so and it's very easy to do and you're done just like that as we move along in the kit building process the next things are the transistors now these are two N7000s and it's if you follow the diagram on the circuit board it's difficult to put these in the wrong way I suppose you could if you tried but it just goes right in there you solder it on the other side that's it it's been less than 15 minutes and look at the progress I've made already I have installed the integrated circuit the switch the little speaker right here and also the battery holder now the Pico Keyer Plus can run off of an external power source like a 9 volt battery but it comes with this coin cell and the holder and believe me it will run off the coin cell for many many months so that's really all you need so let's finish up the circuit board it's been less than 25 minutes and everything is completely assembled on the board as you can see we now reach what I guess you would call a moment of truth according to the instructions when I put the coin cell in the holder the Pico keyer should send 73 to me if I've done everything correctly so let's put the battery in I'll be quiet listen carefully and let's see what happens ah the sound of success now that I have the circuit board finished I know it's working the last step is to just mount it into the optional box that I purchased as you can see it goes in very quickly and easily it takes all of a couple of minutes there are the jacks to key the transceiver and to plug your key in on the back there is the speed control and the control button and you just secure the lid to it and tighten the two screws and you are done as someone may have said once upon a time, the proof is in the sending after all, right? <laughs> in this case, I have the Pico Keyer Plus attached to my CW Touch Keyer Model P6 that I happen to have here. And I'm going to put my microphone very close to the Ham Gadgets Keyer so you can hear exactly what it sounds like as I work the key. Now let's turn the speed up a little bit. Very nice, very smooth. That's the Ham Gadgets Pico Keyer Plus Keyer.